Today I'm going to show you how I transfer my VX tapes onto my computer. The main reason why I'm making this video is because when I first got my VX and I tried looking up how to transfer tapes, no one knew what they were talking about. They said I needed a Mac and a whole bunch of bullshit. So this is the right way to do it. Like I said before, the videos online that I found or that you're probably going to find about VXs are fucking wrong because everyone says you need a Mac or you need one of these things. A fucking digital converter for 60 bucks. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Anyways, I'm going to show you how to transfer tapes. Doesn't matter if you have a VX 2100, 2000, or 1000. They all have Firewire ports. This is the cable here. It's plugged into the back of my computer. Even though your computer probably doesn't have a FireWire port already built into it, most computers have extra slots at the bottom of them to install extra ports. See right here? This is an extra slot, this is an extra slot. This is the FireWire port I installed myself. Now this right here is a FireWire port. 2250 on eBay. Three port PCI 1394 FireWire adapter. Real quick, I'm gonna show you guys how I put the port in my computer. First thing I would recommend is finding where the ports are. Then, you wanna take the side of your computer off. There's gonna be screws in the back somewhere. I already have my screws out because I'm ahead of the game. After you took the side of your computer off and you have access to the ports you're gonna have to pop out one of these metal slots I'm not gonna do that on mine because I already have the port in next thing you would want to do is slide your port into the slot and you can see right down here I have an extra slot definitely make sure you popped out that metal bracket because the wire is gonna need to plug into the back of the port once your ports installed you're gonna probably want to secure it with a screw or something like that just so it doesn't move around this is the port installed right down here now after you installed the port you're gonna want to plug your firewire cable into the back you get one of those off eBay for like 10 bucks or something like that. Once you turn on your computer after installing the port, something should pop up saying driver software was automatically installed. If nothing pops up, you probably did something wrong. Nothing's popping up on mine because I've had the port in for a while now. Now once the driver's installed for the port, you can start transferring tapes. Turn the mode to VCR, and then plug your FireWire port into the VX. After you did that, you can import your video. No need for special software or any of that bullshit. Windows already has it. Your computer will rewind and transfer the tape right from your camera. You can even watch the tape as it transfers. Eventually, you can buy a secondary camera to transfer the tapes for you, so you don't wear down the heads on that valuable VX. Yo. Yo. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. If you have any more questions about VXs, be sure to hit me up. Subscribe. Peace.